In terms of, of, of the circumstance on this particular case, I've also been very clear um, for, for a, some time. I just finished a joint interview with um, um, Marco Rubio that will air on, one, I think, Face the Nation this week. And I have huge concerns about the Chinese Communist Party's influence uh, on, on many of the companies that come from China. I mean, the CCP has the ability to override any company in China, and those companies in China have to be responsible to the Communist Party, not their shareholders, not their customers. Matter of fact, I've done 20 classified briefings, industry sector by industry sector, about um, uh, the, the, some of the concerns I have. And, you know, I'm actively engaged in some of the conversations right now about the national security concerns I have about TikTok. Um, I also know that, that in a whole host of areas, from solar to battery technology, we've got to win back and bring back some of that technology. Uh, on the specific case that was involving Ford and the Chinese company, I don't know any of, of the, uh, I don't know any of the due diligence. I don't have any of the backgrounds. I'm not going to comment on that. Uh, I will stand by my overarching comments, though, that, um, you know, I don't think we need to sever all ties with China. The, we have to figure ways where we can work with them, but we do need to um, recognize that uh, uh, the CCP has an undue influence by Chinese law uh, over many Chinese companies.